Hello, Akamedi. Hey. I have found the bestest quest for us to do. Okay. You should talk to this quite upset girl. Uh, she's upset for a reason. I threw her cat on top of the well. <laughs> well, that's kind of rude. <laughs> she's like, look at her. She was rude. She's a rude little kid. I guess, but I mean, she does have uh, big ears, really big ears. She's kind of cute, though. Yeah, kind of, I guess. I can't. I keep talking to the lady instead of the kid. <laughs> and I'm gonna kill her. <laughs> <laughs> there. I think you could also just directly click her with the mouse to select her more easily. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, I accept it. Okay, very good. So, quest is to rescue cats. Let's go! Rescue There's them, cat. cats, you! Um, I'll, I'll do this. I can, I can, I can climb. God damn it. Yeah, God damn it. <laughs> gotcha! Ah, uh, you're in the lead. <laughs> Need to find more cats. Wait, I think How I got many? quest progress, even though you did it. <laughs> How many cats do we need to find? Uh, the screen just said one out of two, so I guess only two. Oh. That sounds kind of small, because I think I've seen a ton of cats on uh, rooftops while playing the game. Yeah. I think there's uh, some up here as well. It can be difficult sometimes to get the right distance for climbing something. Is it even possible to climb up here? I don't know where you're trying to climb. Okay, I found got a cat. Um, I found two cats. I double win. I'm uh, done. Uh, I'm done too. I want to find more cats, though. <laughs> hey, I could still pick up more cats. <laughs> Do I get a bigger reward if I rescue more cats? Oh, there's a cat up there. But oh no, that sorcerer's. She's gonna take the cat! She's gonna take the cat! <laughs> or she's gonna fall down. No, she's gonna take the cat! No! Yay! Ooh, there's a cat there too. Or does that one even count? It's not really lost, it looks like. No, that one doesn't count. Ooh, there's a cat there! Ah! I'm playing the happy face game now. <laughs> oh. Okay. Um, okay. 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 Maybe that's enough uh, cat rescuing. I'll see what my reward is. I made many happy faces. Like a lot of them. Very good. I got plus 30 something. The whole town loves me. Hopefully I'll find the little girl again. Look for me, I'm standing right next to her. <laughs> there we are, okay. I talk to the woman. <laughs> well, you know, you could just control and then click on her. I'm clicking, I'm damn it! <laughs> well, I'm getting many blue scrolls. How many did you get? Three. Yeah, that's what I got. I was okay. wondering if you got anything extra for your extra cats. I don't I don't know if there's any point in getting extra cats. Okay, so Akavete, I shall now teach you some things I've learned about the game. Okay. Are you ready? Sure. So if you look to the uh, top left part of the screen, mm -hmm. uh, to the right of your level, you have three bars. Right. So the first one... Uh, is your quantity of skill levels? Quantity of skill levels? Oh, like I mean, I mean, I mean skill points, not skill levels. Oh, for like your skill tree. Mhm. Mm okay. The second one is like uh, NPC consumable points, whatever I should call them. That they're, they're used whenever you like uh, do the gossip thing with NPCs with all the smiley faces. Oh. I love that game, that's like my favorite part. <laughs> so you, you use 10 points to do gossip and you use 3 points to greet an NPC. 
And that's to make NPCs like you more? Yeah. Okay. And if NPCs like you more, they might, um, they might like, give you even more quests or other stuff. Give you a free horse. <laughs> so, uh, how many points do you have? I just spent mine, so I have one out of ten. One out of ten. Do you haven't been able to increase the maximum limit? I guess not, unless it's something I have to actually click on. The way you increase the maximum limit is by gaining knowledge. Like, if you press H, you'll get this, uh, like, knowledge database thing where you can see a list of uh, all the NPCs you've um, met and enemies you fought and everything. So okay. if you, like, complete one category, like, for instance, like, find all, find all um, important NPCs in one area, one category will become blue, and I think that will increase it by one. Okay. Um, so, the third bar, I think, is some kind of thing you spend on, like, nodes on the map. It's, it's a thing I'm most uncertain of. It's, it's confusing. Like, it, it, this game is still very Korean, gosh darn it. Yeah. But uh, but yeah, like like the friend, I mean the NPC point thing is those will automatically recharge you. You get like one per minute or one per second minute or something like that. But okay. the third bar, like I think you use them and then they use, but you can like unuse them in some kind of weird way to get them back. I don't know. It's it's a very confusing system. Mm. Uh, okay, so if you manage to get to twelve of those NPC points, then you can steal stuff. Oh, I should try to steal from someone because I have 13 points I can use right now. Oh, is this what you were doing earlier? Uh, well, I've only I've only tried stealing stuff once because I'm because I really have all points available. <laughs> I mean, getting getting more maximum points. Is that what you were doing? Uh, yeah, I try I I tried to gain gain more points. I I noticed I was only one NPC away from having all NPCs in one area, which is the uh, like the. Um, Military camp we visited yesterday. Ah. But yeah, you should find me an, an NPC I can uh, I should steal from. Um. Although I can't do it with all NPCs. Like if you see a symbol, which is like um, I can't remember what, what, what the symbol is. Like a maybe a purse symbol or something. Oh, okay. Um, I'm stupid. I think I also have to be in in the correct position for the icon to even appear. So I. I probably ran past a bunch of NPCs I could steal from. <laughs> but I just didn't oh. I didn't get into the right position. So uh, where are you? Um Guess I can look at the map. Okay. No, okay, I can't steal from him. I'm gonna check the little child. <laughs> <laughs> yep, I can steal from the little child. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> okay, so I guess I'll try her. So can you run back there? Hello. Hello. Okay. I don't know if this matters at all, but I'm gonna crouch before I try this. Maybe I hide in this bush. So if you walk behind the NPC, I think you should see like a purse symbol next to the hand symbol. That's that's for stealing. Oh yeah, I see that. So I'm gonna be really sneaky now and try stealing stuffs. Everybody, the thief is over here! <laughs> God damn it! Okay, I was able to uh, steal. And I got... A... Uh, a... Uh, plate, I think. <laughs> that doesn't sound awfully exciting, but hey! I was able to steal something, yay! Yay! From a little girl. <laughs> I'm so proud of myself. The first time I tried it, I I failed, and then the NPC got mad at me, and I um, and they became like the 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 happy face became not so happy anymore. <laughs> <laughs> they started liking me less. You deserved it. <laughs> so um, another thing I've recently uh, learned. Oh my god, that guy is inside this uh, structure. That is kind of freaky. He looks freaky mm. too. Mm. Okay, can you jump down and follow me? If you insist. Mm -hmm. Bye, kitty friend. <laughs> okay, open the map. 
Okay. Right click anywhere. Do you get like a blue line to uh, towards a location? I did when I clicked one place. When you right clicked it? Yeah. So if you now go back into the game and uh, start uh, start auto run, you will then uh, auto run to that location. Okay. I I I didn't figure that out until uh, earlier today. <laughs> And that's really useful just to, like, just get around uh, stuff uh, in an easy way. Okay, so, um, follow me. And I'll uh, show you another system. You should talk to this NPC who's buried among all these players and horses. Okay. Uh, um, you should have like a shopping cart icon with him. Yeah. Do you have the option to buy from him with a weird interface? Yeah. Uh, how much gold do you have? Where does it show me that? Bottom right. 733. Okay, so uh, let's go with the... Uh, with the, the, the... Like try buying the meat here. And just buy as many as you can. It's, like, it should be fairly obvious what you need to press to buy it. So it defaults to buying 50? Yeah, I, th I think it defaults to buying everything he has. <laughs> but but uh, you should, like, buy, uh, I don't know, like, five. I am I am going with five. Normally I could buy more, but uh, I, 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 can't, I can't carry that much right now because my inventory is kind of stuffed with stuff. Did you do it? Okay, yeah. Okay. You're now carrying a ton of stuff. I only got three. Well, I was more meaning like if you look at your at your character, this is a ton of stuff. Oh, I didn't notice it. And your movement speed is kind of slow. <laughs> yeah. So th this is a system for like um, buying uh, stuff at different locations and then selling it at different locations where it's got a higher price. Hmm. So I guess you can just follow me and then we can try to sell this and hopefully get a little bit of profit. <laughs> okay. And this is especially where the, um, like clicking on the, right clicking on the map and then auto running becomes really useful because you can just do that and then like go get a drink or something. <laughs> <laughs> because you're kind of slow walking like this. Let's see, I think I'll try going here. This is close by. Okay, I have to go the other direction. <laughs> oh. So, uh, you can do this in various ways. Like, if you, have, if you have a donkey, you can let the donkey carry the stuff. The same thing with the horse. I think you can also even get a carriage or even have NPCs carry stuff for you to make this a lot faster than this. Sure. This is the slowest way to do it, and... I've I've only barely seen anyone do it like this. Like most people just use horses, which I imagine is a billion times faster. And I guess this is where the autopilot becomes a little bit confused. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I guess that is something they will iron out once the game is out of beta. Once you're out on like open road, the auto run is is pretty reliable. But in like locations like this, especially, it just becomes really confused. I guess there's a lot more obstacles here. Yeah. Dum de dum. So yeah, with uh, this system, you can gain money a lot, 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 lot faster than any other way. Like if you kill enemies and sell the loot, that's it. That is one way of getting money, but. But you don't get much from that. Mm. Well, well, if you get a few good purchases with this, then you will earn uh, several uh, several thousand uh, gold. That's good to know. Yeah. So, so I think this is one of the primary ways of earning money in the game. So is is the stock of merchants shared between everybody, or is it? I think it's different per merchant, and and they also sell different stuff. I mean, like 
for all the players. Like if if one person buys every every item of stock available from one merchant, will it be empty for everyone else too? Uh, I don't know. I would I would kind of assume that that since it, it is an MMO, like what other people do will affect like the entire server, but but I'm not sure. I do think it's kind of cute, like you get equipment on your character and unique animation for this, but uh, this honestly isn't one of the more exciting things you can be doing in the game. <laughs> yeah. So I think you talk to this person to sell stuffs. You might have to do one thing first before you can sell it. There should be a green uh, button, like a green uh, button with a person on it when you talk to her. Yeah. If you click on that and um, uh, top left part of the screen, is there a button with a minor symbol? Minor? Minus. Min uh, yeah. Uh, you click on that. And then I think this place is basically unlocked for trading. And you know what? the... Um, what I mentioned earlier, like to the right of your... Um, Level number, the third bar. I think you, I think you spend points from that bar when you do this. Okay, that would explain why I can't do it because it requires two points, and I only have one. Really? Yeah. Can you sell the items at all to her? I don't see how. Okay. Well, um, I wish I knew how you could get those points but I guess what he could is just walk back to the city and just sell the items there for zero profit you have to walk all the way back <laughs> I guess <laughs> I I it is, it is it is unfortunate you couldn't unlock it because I because earlier today I just ran to six different locations and I, I, and, I and I had points to unlock all of them so I don't know why you don't have them I don't know what you have to do to get points. Yeah, silly Korean.